Alina Svetolina versus Marketa Von Drusova, the first semi-final for the ladies Wimbledon for 2023. Both ladies have been a surprise to get this far in the tournament. Svetolina started the tournament as an unseated wild card and will take on Venus Williams in the first round. This was easy for Svetolina, getting through in straights, 6-4, 6-3. In the second round, she'd take on the number 28 seed Mertens, and after splitting the first two sets, Svetolina would run away with it, 6-1, 1-6, 6-1. In the third round, she'd take on the qualifier Kennan, who had taken out Goff in the first round. And after a close first set, Svetolina would get through in straights, 7-6, 6-3. Two. In the fourth round, she'd take on the number 19 seed Azarenka. It'd been very impressive throughout the week, and this was a classic. With Svetolina having to fight back from a set down and play a super tiebreak at the end, eventually prevailing in three, two, six, six, four, seven, six, to advance to another Wimbledon quarterfinal. Quarterfinals, Svetolina would take on the number one seed Fiontech, who she hadn't played for a couple of years. And after taking the first set and dropping the second, she would fight through to win in three, seven, five, six, seven, six, two, to advance to another Wimbledon semi-final. When Drusova started the tournament, unseeded, and would take on Stearns in the first round. This is no problem getting through in straight sets. 6-2, 7-5. In the second round, she'd take on the number 12 seed Kudmatova. And again, this was no problem getting through in straight sets. 6-3, 6-3. In the third round, she'd take on the 20th seed Donna Vekic. And this is by far the most impressive performance so far. Getting through in straight sets. 6-1, 7-5. Fourth round, she'd take on the number 32 seed Buzkova, who had just taken out Caroline Garcia in the previous round. And after dropping the first set, She'd have to fight back to win 2 6 6 4 6 3 to advance to the quarterfinals. Quarterfinals, Von Drusa would take on the number four seed Pagula, who had been very solid to get to this stage. And after dropping the second set, Von Drusa would fight back in the final set from 4 1 down, coming back to win 6 4 2 6 6 4 to advance to the semi finals of Wimbledon. These two have played five times before, with Svetlana leading the head to head 3 2, with their last meeting being two years ago at the Olympics. Von Drusa for getting the easy win there on the hard courts, but this will be their first time playing on the grass. Of course, the first time since Svetlina had a kid and started this amazing run. If Von Drusa is going to win this one, she needs to take that confidence that she had at the Olympics. She knows that she can play against Svetlina on a big stage. She proved that two years ago. She's also made a final of a Grand Slam where Svetlina hasn't, so psychologically, she might actually think, hey, I can actually win these because she has won semifinals in the past. Svetlina's going to win this one. She needs to make sure she doesn't get too wrapped up in beating Sviantec because, of course, beating Sviantec isn't the goal. Winning Wimbledon is. So she needs to make sure she gets her head back in the game straight away. And also, she's never won a semi-final at a slam. So maybe take that out of her head as well. Play like this is just a quarterfinal or a fourth round. This is such a random matchup. Nobody thought this was going to be the matchup going in with some of the names at the top of the draw. But I'm going to go with Svetlina to win this one. I think she's a better grass court player than Von Drusova. Von Drusova has been good, but she was a little fortunate that Pagula played bad at the end there. And I think Svetlina is a more accomplished player than Pagula and also more confident. And I think she's going to get to her first Grand Slam final. Not only that, but as a mum, but let me know down in the comments below who's going to make the final.